Hey guys, this is Saurabh Nahar here from All About Technologies and in this video, let's take a look at the camera on the Lenovo K4 Note. Now here is the camera application of K4 Note. From here, you can change your flash settings from auto to on or off depending on what you want. You can also switch between the front camera and the rear camera from here. You have HDR mode here, so you can turn it on if you want and it will be in yellow color if you turn it on. And you also have few other modes like panorama and you can add some effects to your photos. You don't really have a lot of modes on this camera application, just panorama mode and HDR mode, that's it. But you do really have some effects that you can add to your pictures. So that is how it is for this camera application. Now you can also change the resolution of the photo and aspect ratio depending on what you want. So by default it is on 16 is to 9, you can change it to 4 is to 3 or 1 is to 1. The resolution can also be changed and you also have snap mode available. You can touch to take a picture. I have kept it on normal or you can also select smile to take a picture. So when you will smile, it will take the picture. You also can reduce the quality of video by selecting HD. It will shoot in 720p HD. I have kept it on full HD because I like crispy videos. And you have a lot of settings available in the settings panel. So you can change them as per your needs and requirements. I have done that for myself. And here is the shutter speed. It is not the fastest, but definitely it is quite quick. So you can click pictures very quickly. And here is the video mode. If you click this, it will go into video mode, but the timer will be on zero zero. So you have to press this red button to start video recording. And you can also click pictures while taking videos. So that is really awesome. Now, one thing that I don't like about this camera application is that when you try to view all your pictures, you won't be able to zoom a lot into the picture. So that is a slight disappointment, I would say. Apart from it, I don't really have a lot of problems with the camera application on this device. And the same settings are present for the front facing camera as well. The additional setting over here with the front facing camera is that you can also select beauty mode if you want. So that is quite good and it will soften your skin and make you look much better. And you can set the beauty mode from zero to seven. So that is the range you can select depending on what you want. And you can also turn it off if you don't really want that. Now let's take a look at the pictures that were taken with the Lenovo K4 Note. So the pictures that were taken in outdoors and good lighting condition turned out to be really good. I know that you won't really be able to zoom in on your smartphone, which is K4 Note, but if you take it on PC or Mac, you'll see that the pictures look quite good in if they are clicked in outdoors and good lighting condition. And you won't really be disappointed with the camera on the K4 Note when it comes to outdoor and good lighting condition shots. But definitely HDR mode is not all that good on the K4 Note. It doesn't make a huge difference even if you turn it on. So that is one thing. Now if we talk about the pictures that were taken in low light conditions and in artificial light, they were not as impressive as the pictures that were taken in outdoors and good lighting condition because I can see there is a good amount of noise in these pictures. And I was not expecting that to happen with artificial lighting, but I can see noise in the pictures that were taken in artificial light as well. So definitely the camera performs really good in outdoors, but not as good in the low light conditions. If we talk about the front facing camera, the front facing camera has improved a lot compared to the camera that I've seen on the K3 Note. And the performance is really good and I'm happy with the pictures that I've taken outdoors and in good lighting conditions and as well as in artificial lighting conditions. So overall, I'm quite impressed with the front facing camera. Now, if we talk about the video quality of the Lenovo K4 Note, I have taken this full HD video with the K4 Note rear facing camera, which is a 13 megapixel camera. And the video quality is not that impressive, I would say. It does the job, but not that impressive. So this was a quick camera review of Lenovo K4 Note. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button down below. Please hit that like button because it helps us a lot. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see full review of this device. I will be coming up with a full review, which will be 100% genuine. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and you will be notified regarding my full review. And I'll let you know if you should buy this device or not in my full review. And make sure you follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Instagram, Snapchat. All the links will be in the description down below. This is Saurabh Nahar here from All About Technologies. Thank you guys for watching.